In an election, there were four candidates and 80% of the registered voters cast their votes. Not casted their votes. One of the candidates received 30% of the cast votes. While the other three candidates received the remaining cast votes in the proportion 1 is to 2 is to 3. The winner of the election received 2512 votes more than the candidate with the second highest and the number of registered voters was registered voters so some number of registered voters are there since so t 80 percent of them cast their votes cast I'm not talking about caste although in election context that seems like hey that's something people talk about right you're talking about cast votes not cast votes so one of the candidates received 30% of the cast votes. So if you call this as X, one guy gets 30% of X. While the other three candidates received the remaining cast votes in the proportion 1 is to 2 is to 3. So remaining is 70% of X. That gets broken in the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 3. So this 30% goes to one candidate. 70% goes in the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 3 or that these three candidates will get 70 by 6 percent 70 into 2 by 6 70 into 3 by 6 these three fellows 1 plus 2 plus 3 is 6 units break 70 percent into 6 part 1 part 2 part 3 parts 3 out of 6 is half 2 out of 6 is 1 third 1 out of 6 is 1 by 6 so this guy gets 70% by 6, this guy gets 70 into 2 by 3, this guy gets 70 into half, this is 35%. I am very interested in this. Why? Because then that means this guy has won the election. This guy has already got 30, that guy has got more than 30, 35%. This is going to be less than 30%. That I know, 70% by 3. This is half of that, much lesser. Or the guy who won the election, won 35% of the, of the total cast votes. And the guy who came second, won 30% of the total cast votes. Or the difference between these two is 2512, 5% of x is 2512, true, x is the total votes cast, 5% is 1 by 20 or x is 2512 into 20. We want the total number of registered voters, registered voters is 80% of the registered voters is x or 4 by 5 of total registered voters is 2512 into 20 or total number of voters is 2512 into 20 into 5 by 4. 20 into 5 is 100, easy to multiply. Do 2512 by 4 into 100. 2512 by 4, 2512 divided by 4. 6, 11 makes it 232. 628 into 100. 62800 is the number. Okay. Methodically go for it. Nice and simple. Crack it. Next one. Hush.